Morning everyone. Getting a little fuel this morning. Um, today the uh, my 40 by 60 pole barn has arrived. So uh, today's video is going to be unloading that and kind of checking it over and that kind of stuff. So check it out. <sighs> So got everything offloaded and this is what all these items look like. So we got a bunch of directions, got plans inside the house to look at and figure out where everything goes. Uh, went through the checklist, kind of made sure that we had all the parts and pieces and if we don't, um, with general steel you have one week to let them know what you're missing so we'll let them know what's missing a couple items were damaged more like small stuff so we'll get her gonna get a hold of them or my general contractor is and get that stuff coming so we can keep moving along with it and that's where we're at with that All right, so now that the pole barn has arrived, we can kind of talk about a little bit about the layout, what we have going on over here. So let's see as we walk through here and try not to fall down because it's frozen. So over there, we started digging out a pond, found a bunch of natural water. So I think we're going to end up moving the driveway. It's going to kind of be coming in here where I'm walking. I think we're going to head towards this cone over here. A little drier, higher ground there. And then off in the distance, you can see this row of cones. And that kind of represents the property line with the neighbor. Luckily, the neighbor's pretty cool. Gonna let me put my driveway in on his property and then we'll have it come down. You can see we got some deer. So, gonna put the building a little further down there just behind those cones. We have the trees. And then just on the other side of that is a pretty good sized beaver pond. So, all right, well, that's kind of where we're at with this. You can see the building's arrived. We need to get some dirt work going. 
but uh, stay tuned. Give it a like, comment, subscribe, and stay tuned as we talk about putting up this pole barn I got from uh, General Steel Corporation. So thanks for watching, and we'll catch you on the next one.